Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and if you are on Windows 11, the C updates as I was expecting are released. They were released late yesterday, July 21st and are still rolling out to um, everyone on Windows 11. They are optional updates for now until of course Patch Tuesday so optional is just for a few weeks. Um, so all you have to do is add to your settings and go into Windows Update and you should see an optional update that you have to click uh, download and install. That is the bug fixing update only and they fix uh, about a 20, around 20 bugs that Windows 11 had. The two that were the most commonly mentioned is the file explorer crashing. So if you had some file explorer crashes, freezes or problems, it might be fixed in this build because that's one of the major issues that I've seen reported the most. The second most reported one that I see is fixed also. Some of you might have, I've seen that in the past, I don't see it anymore, but I've seen it in the past happen on my Windows 11 machine. You hover over the search, it opens a little you know, dialog, and when you move away, uh, the dialog goes away, but there's kind of an invisible kind of panel that stays open. It's as if when the dialog box goes away, there's kind of a shell of it or some, you know, uh, transparency that is left. And um, the way that I actually noticed it in the past is that when I would go and click something on a page that was within this, I could not click. It's as if I was doing nothing. And the reality is I was kind of clicking through a f kind of a ghost invisible panel, if you want. So that is also reported. That should be fixed on this build for Windows um, 11 also. So on the standard Windows 11, you should be on 22,000.829, 22,000 is the new build once this is installed. You don't have any problems, nothing's wrong, you find that your Windows 11 is working fine, just leave it alone if you want. It will be installed anyways on the next patch Tuesday in August, but for now on, if you don't feel the need to install it for any reason, you can just ignore it, um, as if you ignore it anyways, it doesn't install automatically. So uh, C-band updates are now available for Windows 11 and uh, they fixed, like I said, about 20 different bugs that were reported to Windows 11, but the two most common, the um, File Explorer freeze and the kind of invisible panel that was left when you would hover the search. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.